My first one is this adorable kitty cat mug. It's got the little ears, got the little cat thing. But there is no maker on it. I think it's modern. It's not vintage. I thought I kind of wanted to use it as a succulent planter maybe. I'm really into succulents lately and I'm taking everything I can find and turning it into planters. It's my new obsession. Leave a comment. Let me know what you think I should do. Should I put it up for resale or should I make it into a succulent planter? Maybe I'll make it a giveaway. Let me know. Look at these owls. Aren't they adorable? I love owls. Owls are my class mascot, actually. We're Leitner's wise owls. Well, when I first saw this, I just they just looked like nesting owls and they were all wrapped together like they do at Goodwill. I paid $1.29 for this. When I took them out, I noticed that there was writing on the inside. Small guy here is a quarter cup. Medium guy, a third of a cup big guy is a half cup. These are measuring cups. There's actually a line in here to where to fill it to because I was kind of wondering how much would you do but anyway these are also modern pier one they'd have to go on eBay um, but they're just so cute. Sometimes I just look at this stuff and I'm like oh my god it's so cute I want to keep it but then I turn into a hoarder so I'm probably going to be posting this up on eBay. I think they are so adorable. Okay let's talk succulents. Found this guy for a dollar one at Goodwill. Had them all planted, had succulents in here, found them the other day. Dog knocked him off the table. Broke his tail, broke his leg. My daughter Emily was here, she fixed him for me. She put them all back together and she actually repainted him the same color. So I will be replanting him. Well, I wanna get succulent planters that are unusual things. Speaking of which, today for a dollar 99, I picked up this fish planter. It looks like he's swimming. It actually looks and feels vintage. And the sticker on the bottom, it looks like a vintage sticker as well. Made in Japan, that's all it says. Maybe there's something underneath the price sticker. He is a planter, and I think he's going to make a perfect little succulent planter. I thought he was cute. So another thing that I found that I absolutely fell in love with was this monkey mug. Look at this guy, isn't he adorable? My son had a sock monkey just like this when he was a baby. I don't know what happened to it, but I, when I saw this, I was like, oh my God, I have to have that. Plus the double handles makes it look like his ears and it is double-sided. Cost $1.99 at America's Thrift Store. It is modern, but it is so darn cute that I just had to get him. And I'll probably be putting this guy up on my eBay store. Can't put him on Etsy because Etsy has to be vintage. Another thing that I found, and this is actually new in package, this is a wine stopper. And here's the box for it. I took it out so I could show you what it looked like. Basically, here's the cork. It was like a little mushroom, a little leaf hanging off the ceramic, a poppy, which is very nicely made, a very vibrant color, and this little bee on a wire that's flying above it. I thought that was absolutely adorable. I paid a dollar for it, and I'll probably put it up on my Etsy shop or eBay. Brand new inbox. Christmas wine tumblers, a set of two by Kate Spade in conjunction with Lennox. Retail for $40, that's what the original price tag says. I paid $1.29 and I'll actually probably wait until November to post this up when the Christmas rush comes around because no one's gonna buy anything Christmassy now. Back to succulents, I found this basket. It also looks kind of old, it is unmarked. It was obviously a planter or something before. Someone had something in it, probably fake flowers. But I'm gonna clean that out and I'm actually going to put dirt in it and put real succulents in there. Oh, I just noticed that it was cracked and repaired. Oh well, I'll cover it up with a flower. This is probably about as plain as I wanna go with my succulent planters. I really wanna plant things that are unusual. So if you find anything out there that are unusual planters and unusual shapes, like this or this, let me know. This is a fake flower that I'm going to pull out and throw away, but I really liked the pot that he was in, and I thought I could put like a cute little succulent in it. It looks very like Mayan, and of course it's fake, it's not anything. I paid $1.99, of course the dollar for the plant that I'm gonna throw away, and then a dollar for the little pot. So I'm gonna use this little pot as a little planter for outside. Is this little torch, it's a tabletop torch. You put your fluid in here, you light the wick, and this is for outside in the summertime. Pay $2 for it. Um, and I'm gonna keep this because I like it. 
and I like to sit outside. This will help keep the mosquitoes away. Many of you may or may not know, I'm a teacher during the year. I'm gonna be teaching fourth grade this year. And I found these two big packs of what's known as a ticket out the door. Any of you teachers out there sure know what a ticket out the door is. And I had to pick it up because I just thought they were cute. And something for the kid at the end of the day to write something they learned, questions they have, or some, an important point to remember. And then they turn it into the teacher. That's it for this haul. I will be back because I'm obsessed with thrifting. I will let you see more things that I find. If there's anything you see that you absolutely would love to have, contact me via email, fantasticfindsbyme at gmail.com. Find my Facebook page, Fantastic Finds by Me, or Fantastic Finds by Me on Etsy, and Fantastic Finds by Me on eBay. I hope you enjoyed this week's haul video. Give me a like if you want to see more content like this. Please don't forget to subscribe and share with all your friends. Comment down below. I'll take complaints. I'll take compliments. I'll take anything. Thank you very much for watching. Have a great week. See you next time.